Old Trafford is the venue, and this is a confrontation with genuine historical significance. As far as this match is concerned, who's going to come out on top between Manchester United and Arsenal? Stay tuned to find out live here on EA TV. Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Manchester United up against Arsenal. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, he's bound to be disappointed with himself. Not a great effort, Stuart. Well, the less said about that, the better. Not a good decision from him. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Well, on paper, it's down as a 4-5-1. But for me, it's more likely to be a split midfield with three supporting the front man and two sitting that little bit deeper as defensive cover. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Declan Rice starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. And pressing from the front. Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Committed challenge. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, he's a fantastic striker of the ball and can generate so much pace. And when he strikes it... Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, a clear and early statement of intent from the referee. It's a booking, Stuart. Well, the referee has made it absolutely clear he's not going to mess around here. Functioning wall. Well, the last touch came off the defender, so a corner now. Short corner favoured. The delivery. Arsenal's free kick here. Well, warned by the referee, but not cautioned. Yeah, and I think he's got that absolutely right. You don't want to be throwing cards about left, right and centre. far too close to him well a really good run but nothing comes of it now can they counter clinically he takes a pretty simple for the keeper a really good run and his teammate got him out of trouble and promising stuff from Arsenal a chance to whip it in oh dear not a great effort was it A 
and really pressing their opponents. Rashford. Shot attempted. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Playing it short. McTominay. Reading it well. Can he find the net? Great block again. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Oh, great defending. Well, that was all down to the pressure applied. And a throw forthcoming. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. It might be. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Bruno Fernandes has it. Of challenge. Marcus Rashford. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. For Lange. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. William Saliba. Rice. always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball Bruno Fernandes has it Scott McTominay it's a fine United move in the making and a fine reading of the situation plenty of support here Diogo Dallo. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Rashford. Rashford! The save was a good one. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Can someone get on the end of this? And so the referee blows the whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Old Trafford. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. It certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Well-timed tackle. Thomas Partey. They know they need to stop him. And that's easy peasy for the keeper.
Arsenal pushing forward with options available. He succeeds in clearing it. Oh, he's blocked it! Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Can he play it in? And cleared away. It's going to be United's free kick. Casemiro. Oh, breezing past him. Nicely blocked. A spot on with that challenge. Nicely timed tackle. Sustained pressure and they have the ball now. Rashford. So a half an hour remaining. Diogo Dallo. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. Vigorous defending. Arsenal's free kick here. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Thomas Partey, committed challenge. Might really be able to trouble them here. But they took care of the situation defensively. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Can they forge ahead? Look like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Well, they could give it away. Arsenal regaining possession. And he has options available. Well, the United fans can sense a winner coming here, but can they create one more big chance? Into the final 20 minutes. This looks more than decent. And it's played into the centre. Oh, that's a fine save. And time for the change now. They're going for the short one. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. And cleared off the line. Good example of pressing without the ball. And support available. But quick thinking defensively. Now can they counter clinically? Can they use it to their advantage? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Jesus. Manchester United venture forward. Do they have a winning goal in the future?
Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. Bukayo Saka. That's useful play. How about the cross? And thumped away. And a fine cross. And an effective clearance. Jorginho. Can he put them in front? He does. And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. On to Wan Bissaka. Now with Rashford. Scott McTominay. Manchester United battling the clock and the scoreline. Not troubling the keeper. Jesus. chance oh a magical piece of goalkeeping well he's just pulled off a great save there such good reactions it really is and the short option preferred now smuggled behind for another corner Taken short. Oh, he looks threatening. And stifled by Casimiro. Can he finish them off? Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Emphasis on the clearance. A good one. Well, these United fans can sense an equaliser here, but can the players respond? William Saliba. Gabriel Jesus and so there it is the final whistle and Manchester United have lost this game much to the disappointment of their supporters yes Derek there was very little in it for much of the game I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least and it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on but they just have to bounce back now on well, a strong individual statement from Jorginho you've got to say how would you sum up what he put into the game? Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 